What is going on SoFi fans? Welcome back to Trending Stocks. Over the last little bit, what has come from SoFi has been just next level stuff. It's been all playing out perfectly. So I want to give you a good overview of some of the data points where I see things going, at least in the short term and all the other fun jazz that you need to know. But first, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and subscribe. I always greatly appreciate that. With that, let's get right to it. So today it is up 3.16%. It did break the $9 range and it's trying to once again. So maybe premature but welcome back to the nines i think in reality based on the momentum and a lot of the data points it's already showing right now things are going to look a lot more better um, in the coming days for sofi but of course just want to go over some of the data points like i said at the time of doing this video there is been no recent sec filings and no press releases so this is legitimately just a lot of fomo just a lot of side action to obviously the whole student loan business and so forth and just a lot more optimism in regards to sofi so i want to go over some of the data points one of which is options activity so today even though the market's been open less than one hour there is 2.22 million dollars in calls being purchased and there is 300 66,000 inputs. So this is just insane for a Friday. Typically Fridays are very quiet on a side note, but today looks like everyone just woke up, decided to buy SoFi. And based on this, clearly it does show and indicate that people are anticipating it to continue to go up. Looking as far as this, it is anticipated to be around the $9.50 to $10 range in the coming weeks. So one to two weeks out, which is absolutely epic as well. Like I said, the market has been open about one hour less than that, actually. And these are all the transactions that did occur so far in the secondary market. 2.44 million clearly is a fairly good one. But even looking back at yesterday, 6.51 million, 2.4 million. So a lot of big money is getting still into SoFi, even though it has gone up quite a lot over the last little bit as you can see right here but still like i said i do feel that even based on what has been happening even around here it should have been at 850 from the get-go unfortunately there's just been a lot of manipulation coming from analysts and as you can see some analysts are still giving downgrades but yet they're starting to kind of adjust their price target to make them not seem like fools for instance similar to what wedbush did because wedbush i think they gave initially a I think it was a $3 or a $2 target, which ultimately did cause it to get down to this low of $4.45. So hats off once again to everyone who did buy. Luckily enough, even I myself did buy in around here. Unfortunately, not the low low. So it'd been nice to have the $4, but $6 and change is where I did get in. And as well, I actually did buy because I, I could tell when it was going to go down that it most likely was going to bounce. But regardless, I do feel that SoFi is a very long long-term investment and what has been happening this is just the tip of the iceberg so i did buy in i think it was at eight dollars and twenty cents whatever it is but still i do believe that sofi is going to do a lot of good things and in similar cases i cover a lot of other companies and like i said one of the biggest changes and aspects of sofi that i really do like is just the ceo the ceo is guiding sofi in the right direction and of course him buying physical shares is just you can't kind of make that stuff up like this does not happen so in reality i think sofi is very much poised to have a lot of good upside potential and clearly based on this um, big money is buying looking at the multiples in reality this is still considered a, a fairly good discount in my opinion so the current ps ratio is 4.9 the future is 3.9 so in reality i think there is still a lot more room for it to go even in this round of course today is the last day of q2 so when it comes down to the forecast it does look like some analysts did jump on board and gave some estimates so it went from around 11 analysts to now 13 with a average Average of negative 06 for earnings per share and as you can see good old 2024 at least Q4 2023 there might be profitability coming fairly soon. So SoFi, like I said, is on the right trajectory. I want to give you a good overview of, for instance, what shorts are doing because short score, oddly enough, that has gone up a little bit as well. So short score is currently 66. Utilization is 47.18%. And on a side note, I know I do go through a lot of information fairly fast. So if there's anything that you guys have any questions on, let me know in the comments. I can definitely address that. 
but shorts are right now returning 126.32 thousand shares 16.08 percent of the free flow is being shorted which is kind of high in my opinion 128.2 million shares overall are being shorted so the fact that they are returning on a very much green day goes to show that maybe they made the wrong mistake so i think some of them are starting to do that so i anticipate a little bit more of a further closure which of course will just boost the stock price a little bit more in the coming days going into next week so what is coming next that's what people want to know despite it going up as much as it did stochastic is currently at 42 which is kind of neutral but there is a nice bullish sentiment that is behind the scenes momentum shows number of retail investors are starting to get back in today so of course i think today is just especially with it touching the nine dollar range i think this does signal its continuation of the momentum behind the scenes and looking here so at the fib levels so with it being eight dollars and 98 cents it is currently between this r2 and the r3 so eight dollars and 91 cents is that big support the closest support that you need to watch for prior to that um, 866 as well and of course on its way up the next big thing for you to watch for is nine dollars and 32 cents so like i said let me know you guys' thoughts on sofi in the comments below do you think that it is going to continue do you think we're going to be seeing tens first or sevens that's actually a very good question what do you guys think about that i personally feel who isn't a financial advisor of course so you guys always do your own due diligence i feel that we are going to see tens prior to any potential sevens once again because like i said all the data points that i did bring up even surprisingly shorts are all very optimistic so once again, let me know you guys' thoughts on all this in the comments below. If you haven't already, hit that thumbs up and subscribe. I always greatly appreciate that. And if you do like my channel and support the growth, take a look at my memberships, link in the description below, or just hit the join button at the bottom of the screen. With that said, appreciate you guys watching. Let's all make a lot of money on SoFi.